Well, in honor of our 40th season on the air, it's time for another Lawmakers Flashback. Tonight, more from 1971, a committee hearing on fire ant eradication held in the House chamber. Listen closely for a reference to Department of Agriculture Commissioner Tommy Irvin. <laughs> committee on how we feel about it. All the people in the gallery here, lots of them here today, that are, are trying to do something about this terrible pest in Georgia. And if, if we don't get the appropriation to do this job like we're supposed to be done, like they've outlined here to do, like the USDA man has said we've got to do it, like Mr. Irvin has told us we've got to do it, then we're going to just wind up with a state of being completely ruined by this pest. If we don't stop them now, then they will be stopped. Please help us do something about it. Contact the members of the appropriation committee. Get them to support the appropriation for the fire and eradication program and I assure you we'll do everything in our power to do something about it. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Matthews. I wonder if you wait just a minute and see if there are any questions, please, sir. Yes, sir. Does anyone have any questions of Mr. Matthews? Thank you. Thank you, sir. Fire ant eradication was a popular concept in the South in the 1960s and 70s, but political support waned and the chemical Myrex was later banned as a pesticide. This has been a Lawmaker's Flashback. <laughs>